Okay, in the next slide, so we will see the next problem. How many tiles whose length and breadth, breadth are 12 cm and 5 cm respectively will be needed to fit in a rectangular region whose length and breadth are respectively. Okay, so just look at the problem. How many tiles whose length and breadth are 12 cm, 5 cm respectively will be needed? Okay to fit in a rectangular region to fit in a rectangular region how many will be needed okay whose length and breadth are respectively in the first case they given 100 cm and 144 cm okay so second case 70 cm and 36 cm okay let us look at the first problem you will see that answer for the first problem see here area of the region first we need to find the area of the region so what is the area of the region see here so the first one 100 centimeter 144 centimeter so that means this is a rectangle shape so we have to multiple that the two values we will get one identical value okay so uh, what is called 14400 centimeter square so area of one tile so area of one tile they mentioned no what is that area of the one tile so 12 cm length, 5 cm breadth, okay. So we have to find the area of that 1 tiles, okay. So 1 tile, so 5 cm into 12 cm, 5 into 12, 60 cm square, okay. So number of tiles which should be equal to that area of the region, total region, okay. Area of the total region divided by area of 1 tiles. So this is called number of tiles, how many tiles you need, that means what is the total region and what is that area of one tile that means how many number of tiles we can insert that we need to, we need to find okay so see here so just a minute okay so here for, for 14400 okay so divided by 60 okay so divided by 60 which is equal to see here yes so 14,400, so number of tiles which should be equal to area of region divided by area of one tile. So 14,400 divided by 60, this 0, this 0 cancel. So 1, 6 are 6, okay. So 2, 6 are 12, okay, remaining 2, that 2 will come here 24. So 4, 6 are 24, then here on 0, no. So 240 tiles are required, okay. Just understand the problem, okay. Just understand see here how many tiles that means number of tiles they ask whose length and breadth are 12 cm 5 cm this is for one tile will be needed to fit in a rectangular region that means rectangular surface whose length and breadth are respectively so that means 100 cm 144 cm that is a rectangular region in that region so if you found the area of this particular value then after if you found that value of that uh, area of value of that one tile then we can find how many tiles so same manner in the second problem we can do okay the second problem see here so same way area of region so area of region what is the given value 70 centimeter and 36 centimeter Okay, so if you multiply this, multiply this two value, we will get 2520 centimeters square. Okay, so what is that area of one time? So they have mentioned in the previous problem as well as in the question also. So 5 centimeter into 12 centimeter, if you multiply, you will get area of one tile. Okay, so how to find the number of tiles required? So what is the total figure area, total region area and then area of one tile means, you know, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, this much uh, tiles, 10, slide, 10 tiles, um, uh, 20 tiles approximately we can okay we can say okay if you know that one tile value and total value we can find the number of tiles okay so here the number of tiles which is equal to area of region divided by area of one tile okay so here see here 2520 divided by 60 okay so 2520 divided by 60 which should be equal to uh, 42 okay 42 
tiles are required if you cancel this 0 and this 0 and 252 divided by 6 okay 4 6 are 24 remaining 1 that one value will come here 12 so 2 6 are 12 so 42 tiles are required okay so this is that uh, for the fourth problem okay uh, for this slide okay for first problem okay uh, the next problem is to be very easy just uh, think about split the following shapes into rectangles and find their areas okay the measures are given in centimeters so the measures are given in centimeters they will give the value in centimeter so they are going to give one shape that shape you are going to find the area how to find the area means you are going to split the shape into area area of rectangle and area of square any area okay so from that two okay so can we look at the model problems okay just uh, look here okay this is the problem number one okay so see here this is 2 represent 2 centimeter 10 represent 10 centimeter 12 represent 12 centimeter 8 that means sir so what are this one from here to here okay from here to here 10 centimeter from here to here 8 centimeter from here to here 2 centimeter from here to here 10 centimeter from here to here 12 centimeter from here to here 2 centimeter okay so do you know what kind of shape it is okay in your while you are going to celebrate the birthday that time okay so you have taken one L kind of shapes we are having one scissor okay so just take the scissor and cut along this direction straightly you are going to take one scissor and cut it along that uh, 8 see 8 no uh, in that 8 it's directly from this corner cut it straightly what will happen how many rectangle you will get can you guess any guess of course there are two rectangle okay so this kind of problem how to do first they gave one shape we have to convert the shape into either square or rectangle okay so any shape you have to make it one cut and then you can solve the problem okay first look at here this one two centimeter so see here I am splitting this figure here see here so I am giving the letter A B C here D and E F G okay so first one I am going to split along this direction straightly you are going I am going to split see here one dot dot lines no so this one if you split this shape how many rectangle will get this one rectangle and this one rectangle there are two rectangles possible okay rectangle we have to find the area right so here from here to here totally 12 okay so from here to here 2 from here to here 2 means opposite to value see here look at this here, here from here so that means if you make one draw one line means here what is this value that means de value what is the de value so this one 2 means this also 2 so this one 2 means this also 2 that means we can find the area easily so this one 12 represent a to e okay a to e okay not from a to d okay so 12 so that means we split means here a to d which represent 10 here 10 means here also 10 this 12 which not mention the value of a d this 12 represent the value of a e so then what about the value of a d means so this one 2 means this also 2 so 12 minus 2 you will get 10 okay so just uh, look at the answer okay so area of rectangle a b c d okay so a b c d okay see here so a b c d see here 2 into 10 because this is breadth this is length so 2 into 10 20 centimeter square then area of the rectangle d e f g d e f g so this one 2 means this also 2 sir this one 10 this one 8 only they given sir from this 2 that means from c to g only 8 d to g means dc value we have to find so dc value how to find 
this value 2 means exactly opposite this value 2 so 2 plus 8 totally 10 okay so that means 10 into 2 so 10 multiplied by 2 we will get the answer 12 20 centimeter square so total area of the figure we have to add 20 plus 20 40 centimeter square so this is your answer for the first figure okay so how to find first they will give this kind of shape you are going to make one cut after you are cutting find the value of that one then after here just make into two rectangle okay two rectangle and in that two rectangle you have to find the length and the breadth from the given data okay from the given data then after we have to proceed the form formula okay so the next figure which means see here and uh, just look at see all the sides they give 7 7 7 they give okay so first one what to do here 7 here 7 here 7 here 7 7 7 so 7 means 7 centimeter 7 centimeter 7 centimeter 7 centimeter so everything 7 centimeter how to find the area of this figure okay so you are going to make one drawing or one cut okay suppose if you have taken the scissor you are going to cut here one cut and then after here one cut then after here one cut here one cut so after you are cutting this kind of shape how many square you are getting 1 2 3 4 and 5 so because after you are cutting so here one shape is there no that shape also square okay so as we know that square side <coughs> sorry a square side that value should be 7 centimeter right so okay so the 7 centimeter here 7 here 7 here 7 okay so after you are cutting here 1 2 3 okay here and center also you will get one square so totally how many square is possible 1 2 3 4 5 so what is this value this value 7 centimeter that means what about this value 7 centimeter this value 7 centimeter means what about this value 7 centimeter and this value 7 means this value 7 and this value 7 means this value 7 so totally how many numbers of square totally 5 square each side value 7 centimeter of course exactly see here so there are 5 squares each of side 7 centimeter is there so area of 1 square which should be which we have to find okay what is the area of 1 square what is the value here side value 7 centimeter here side value 7 centimeter so area of 1 square 7 multiplied by 7 7 into 7 which is which should be equal to 49 centimeter square okay so area of 5 squares that means 49 multiplied by 5 okay so 49 multiplied by 5 why we have to multiply by 5 because for 1 square which should be equal to 49 that means 5 square 49 into 5 so 9 5 sir here 45 and here 4 5 sir 20 24 so 245 centimeter square so this is your answer okay so how to find this kind of problem so don't get confusion they gave one figure means just take one pencil split into number of triangle or number of rectangle or rectangle and number sorry number of triangle not sorry number of square and number of rectangle so you can make either square or rectangle or combining of the rectangle and square also then after you have to find after you are cutting that side value you have to find then after finally if you multiply it means you will get the answer okay so okay okay that's all for the today's session so anyway i hope you all understand so if you cannot understand just see the video once again and uh, read the problem twice okay and uh, for area of remaining that is one model question find the cost that is one model question and they gave one figure that means they gave one shape we have to find the area of that shape the three model question i taught today so just look at the problems once again take your cw and what are the problems today i taught that problem you can copy in your cw
okay so i hope you all understand once again um thank you for all okay so thank you all